How do you find the angles with vertices inside? So we're not talking about the center angle where the center is F here. It's going to be inside the triangle, but I mean inside the circle, but not at the center. What we need to do is, yes. No. You find the average of, shh. So when you're looking for this angle, C, A, B, or that, these two are equal because they are vertical angles. Draw the line so you can find two intercepted arc for that angle. So you see how this is intercepted from that angle and this is intercepted from that angle. So when it's inside, you're finding the average, meaning you add these two numbers together and then divide it by two. So add it first and then divide it by two. Don't try to put everything all together. So it's 120 degrees divided by two, which is 60 degrees. So this is 60. Then we know the vertical angle is 60. Guess what this angle will be then? They make a linear pair. They make 180. So you can subtract from 180 to get these two. Okay. No, when it's a line, you can subtract. So let's try an example question here. In circle F below, F is usually referring to the center of the circle. If they call it circle A, A is the center. Circle O, O is the center. And measurement of arc DC is 70. And measurement of arc BE is 80. What is the measure of angle CAD? CAD. What kind of angle is it? It's inside, but not the central angle. So again, what do you do? So these two will be the same. So draw the lines and find the intercepted arc. It's this one and that one. If it's inside, what do you do? You add and divide by two. So it is 70 degrees plus 80 divided by two, which is 150. Guys, don't try to put everything at once unless you put parentheses. Just add it first, press enter, and then divide by 2, which will give you 75 degrees. So if that's 75, we know this is also what? 75 by vertical angles. What's the next question? Angle A, B, A, E. B, A, E. Vertical angles, so they are the same. What about angle C, A, B? CAB must be linear pair with 75, so you do 180 minus 75, which is 105. Okay. So guys, they might be a question like this as well. They're not going to always give you the intercepted R. They might give you these two, but not this side. Then what do you do? You can just call this what? X. And just set up an equation and you start solving it. So 70 plus x divided by 2 must be equal to what? 75. They might give you these two instead of these two. You see? Then what do you do? You multiply 2 by 2 on both sides and start solving for x. Okay? You multiply 2 on both sides. And then 70 plus 8, x is 150. Then you can subtract 70. You can subtract 70 to get the other arc. Okay? You can have different application problems from adding, finding these angles.